Hey everyone, this is Steve from Publish Press, and if you're looking for publishing plugins for WordPress, you're in the right place. In this guide, I'm going to show you how to prevent WordPress users from adding a specific category or tag. This is an example that came from a real Publish Press user. They had a whole bunch of categories on their site, but they wanted to make sure that at least one of those categories was not available to some users. The example they had was Article of the Month. They wanted this to be reserved only for administrators who could give the seal of approval to some posts. So this category is not going to be available to regular authors. The way to do this is to use the Publish Press Permissions plugin, and that allows you to block or allow access to categories, posts, tags, or other post types in a really flexible way. I have it installed on my site here, and it appears under permissions in the left menu. I'm going to go to the settings area. I'll click on core, and here I can decide which post types and which taxonomies are being restricted. So we're all set because both categories and tags are being restricted by Publish Press permissions. Now I'm going to go to Posts and Categories, and I'm going to click on Edit for the Article of the Month category that I want to restrict. Now I can scroll down. The first box is to Read Posts. Now we're talking about editing and applying the category to different posts. So that's not quite what we need. I'm gonna minimize that box for now. And editing posts in this category. Well, if you want to, if you add a particular category, you can block some users from editing those posts. But again, that's not quite what we need. What we need is assigning this category to posts. We don't want authors to be able to add this category to any posts. So down here, we have each WordPress user role, administrators, authors, contributors, editors, subscribers, and I'm gonna set authors to blocked. Now, you're not going to be able to use this category if you're an author, and you're not going to be able to use any subcategories of this category either. Click update. And if I add a new post as an administrator, I'm going to have the choice of five different categories in the right sidebar. So that's the basic permissions that we're starting from. Let's see what happens to the author now. If I go to the users link in the left menu, I have an author. You can see his role as author. I have an author whose name is John Smith, and I'm going to test his account. I have a plugin installed that helps me do that automatically. You can just log in and log out, or open up another browser to test an author account. I'm going to go to Posts, click on Add New, and let's see what categories we have available to us. In the right sidebar, we only have four. So what I've done is restrict the author role from using this particular category in any way. The same thing is possible for tags as well. I switched back to my administrator account. And if I go to tags, I could create an article of the month tag. And exactly the same thing would be possible for tags as well. I'm going to minimize the read option and the edit option and go to the assign option. I can set the author role to blocked and they are not going to be able to use this tag on any post that they create. So publish press permissions is a really flexible way to allow or block access to some parts of the publishing process in WordPress. There's also a pro version, plus lots of other good tutorials like this, available at publishpress.com. 